Hello, beautiful shining friends. Welcome to a brand new week. My name is Isabel. I'm a licensed naturopath, a holistic life coach, and a spiritual guide and channel. And every week I come to you to bring you some guidance from the Akashic field and some inspiration and just a whole bunch of love and positive energy to help you move forward with your intentions, with your goals, with your dreams, and just to create a more powerful and holistically healthy and balanced life and lifestyle. And um, I'm really, really about a holistic well-being, which really means not only is your body healthy in the way that is that fits your lifestyle, but your mind is strong and thriving and able to support you towards your goals and on your journey and that your emotional well-being your heart is open your heart is open to receive your heart is open to be vulnerable your heart is open to create a space for yourself and then those around you the people that you love and basically just the people around you and if you can even further than that some well-being, some kindness, some compassion. And I truly believe that the more we can help ourselves be authentic, be aligned, be fully um, our truth, we can absolutely project that out into the world. And sometimes we're just going to be so much kinder, so much more understanding and pleasing and patient. Oh, please, please, please bring in the patience. <laughs> All right, beautiful people. So today is October uh, 6th, but this is, you're receiving it on October 7th because I am still doing my full fasting journey. I've been fasting for over 30 years because it's part of my practice it's part of my rituals and it's part of my lifestyle and i feel it is a fantastic way to keep your body healthy and strong as long as you are supported on the journey and supported by someone that is very knowledgeable and able to answer all your questions and make sure that the journey for you is uh, fantastic so this being said, this is why I am doing it Sunday instead of Monday, um, because I'm probably going to be breaking my fast tomorrow. It'll be day 11 of full fasting for me. And I'll see if I'm breaking it tomorrow, but I'm pretty sure I'm going to be breaking it tomorrow. Anyways, all right. So this week is such a beautiful week. If you have not had a chance to set your goals and your intentions for the last quarter of 2024, for the new moon that came in, for the solar eclipse, for the week, any or all of the above, do it now. All right. This is the perfect week to do it. This week is full of this beautiful, um, powerful energetic energy right and it is this kind of energy that it is okay let's do it this way you have the yin you have the yang i'm sure you all know what that is that little symbol and they come together and they fit beautifully together and this week it is mostly yang and the yang flows into the yin that means there are some down moments not down bummed out but down like just kind of you know relaxing and feeling into uh, the moment and taking time to breathe and maybe meditate go for a walk spend some time in nature so i'm calling that the downtime so there's definitely some of that this week but during your downtime. You're going to feel this beautiful, healthy excitement about yourself, your goals, and your life. So the rest of the time will be just you feeling motivated and excited and energized and actually taking steps 
maybe even some scary steps towards all of that. You're not only going to be pulling it in with uh, your words and your vibration and your, your emotions, what it is that you want to pull in as your lifestyle, you're also going to be taking some solid steps towards that or in that or through that. And the actual part of moving, of doing, is a lot more yang energy. And when you do those things, you're going to feel this incredible sense of joy and positive pride and excitement. And you're going to take these feelings and you're going to bring them into that yang part of your week where you're you're just kind of chilling. <laughs> and even without taking concrete action at that specific moment, you're going to feel the same excitement, the same joy, and it's going to ooze out of you, out of your bubble and into the field. And you're just going to be attracting more and more and more positivity, positive, um, in, positive emotions, positive frequencies, positive people, positive situations. And you're going to start creating more and more in this space of well-being for your goals, for yourself, and for those around you. Mm. Isn't it just an awesome week? Aren't you like totally excited? Yes, totally excited. So I do encourage you, if you have not this week written down goals, taken, uh, you know, gotten your agenda ready for what you want to do, even if it's things like meditating, drinking more water, being going for walks, being more active, taking care of your body so it can support you right? During all these great things that are coming, I encourage you to do that now. Just take a few moments and set yourself a direction, align with it, bring it into your heart, really feel the excitement about it and go. That's it. Go. All right. If you are enjoying this and you are on my channel and not yet subscribed, make sure that you subscribe, leave a like and a positive comment for myself and everyone else that reads the comments, it is so nice and uplifting. If you would like to share something, make sure that you tag me. I would love to hear about it because it is always so wonderful to hear how you're doing. And on this note, I am sending you so much love from my heart, so much light. Have a fantastic week and I'll see you soon. Bye for now.